بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم دا گورنمنٹ رولڈ آؤٹ آن ٹیوزڈے دا پاسبلٹی آف امپوزنگ این اکانمک ایمرجنسی ان دا کنٹری ٹو ڈیل ود ون آف دا ورسٹ کرائسس ان اٹس ہسٹری بٹ سیڈ اٹ واز کنٹمپلیٹنگ انرجی کنورزیشن میجرس ٹو ریڈیوس دا امپورٹ بل ان اے اسٹیٹمنٹ دا فائنانس منسٹری سیڈ دیٹ دا گورنمنٹ ریمین کمیٹیڈ ٹو دا انٹرنیشنل مانیٹری فنڈ پروگرام اینڈ دا ٹاکس فار اسٹارٹنگ دا ریویو انڈر دا پروگرام آر ایٹ این ایڈوانس اسٹیج A false message on supposed economic emergency proposals has been circulating on social media in recent days. Finance division not only strongly rebuts the assertions made in the said message but also categorically denies it and that there is no planning to impose economic emergency, the statement said. Interestingly, out of the nine points mentioned in the social media message, at least two were already under implementation related to curb on imports. while one about energy conversation was actively under consideration on the advice of the state bank of the pakistan the message is unfortunately aimed at creating uncertainty about the economic situation in the country and can only be spread by those who do not want to see pakistan prosper the ministry said adding that the creation and spread of the such false messages was against national interest in these times of economic hardship A mere reading of the nine points mentioned in the message indicates how far fetched those suggestions are. According to the finance ministry, it is also quite inappropriate to equate Pakistan with Sri Lanka, given inherent strength and diversity in Pakistan's economy. It added, Pakistan needs a minimum $32 billion to $34 billion in the current fiscal year to finance its debit and bridge the current account defect gap. The foreign inflows in the first four months remained at $4.2 billion. The present difficult economic situation is mainly the result of exogenous factors like commodity super cycle, Russia-Ukraine war, global recession, trade headwinds, Fed's increase in policy rates, and devastation triggered by unprecedented floods, according to the ministry.